Of Pashtun tribal ethnicity and Pakistani nationality, few expected this girl to become such an empowered personality. For here the birth of a girl, unlike that of a boy, is not marked by celebration, pride, or even particular joy. Her parents chose Malala as her given name, after Malala of my wand, a heroine of Afghan fame. During the second Anglo-Afghan war this woman would tend to the Afghan troops who against the British invasion did defend. As the British advanced and the Afghan flag bearer fell, Malalai lifted her veil and commenced a battle cry to yell. She was killed in the battle, but her brave act and rousing oratory inspired the Afghans to reverse the tide and on to victory. Like her namesake, Malala would make her own heroic stand and one day raise her voice against an oppressive demand. Islamic fundamentalists seized power in her part of her beloved nation, encouraging Sharia law, including depriving girls of education. To Malala, this was an Islamic faith grave misinterpretation, so she resisted in action and speech with strong determination. For her efforts, she would one day take a bullet to the head, but her courageous voice was not silenced, but rose instead. Her defiant stand against oppression and her miraculous survival put her on an international stage and offered us all a revival of the old adage that refuses to be ignored, perhaps the pen is indeed mightier than the sword.